Hey everyone, I'm here to share with you guys my week one of Focus T25. I've been enjoying the workout so far. It is really hard to work non-stop for 25 minutes with no breaks in between. Seriously, I sweat as much as I did with doing Insanity for an hour or a little over an hour. It's crazy, but I'm really enjoying it. Um, so far, um, I haven't seen any change in my weight or measurements, but in my picture, I have seen a difference. So first, I'm going to go ahead and share with you all my measurements and my weight. Here you can see my weight basically has stayed the same. I gained 0 0.02 of a pound, and my all of my measurements have stayed the same, except for the measurement of my thigh, which went down a half an inch. So that's a good thing, I guess. So far, the hardest workout for me is definitely the total body circuit which I did on Wednesday. It was crazy. I was so sore. My chest and shoulders were crazy sore. My abs and my legs because total body you're doing everything that day and it's 25 minutes non-stop no break. So now here I'm going to share a picture with you that's including my final result of insanity. And there's a reason I want to share this with you all. I completed day 63 of Insanity on July, no, sorry, June 24th. And I started day one of Focus T25 on August 19th. That's almost two whole months that I was just like completely lazy in between programs. And here you can see in the picture that I almost completely lost all of my progress that I had earned with doing insanity. I was starting to get ripped. That On the left photo you can see my day 63 of insanity and I was getting ripped. I was tight. My belly wasn't poking out anymore. And then in the center picture, this is my day one a week ago of Focus T25. I still have a little bit of the definition in my obliques, uh, but my belly came out a little bit more. It's just not looking as good as it should have been had I kept working out for the entire two months. But from day one to day seven, which is today, I do see a little bit of a difference. My belly is going back in. I'm seeing the, a little more definition in my obliques and my abs. So I'm super excited to continue to make progress and to tighten up. And you know what I've learned from seeing these pictures? And this is like an epiphany to me just today that I realized when I put these three photos side by side and with the dates. This is not a one and done type of deal. And what I mean by that is you don't go through one workout program for two months, get great results, and then just stop and expect to keep your results. I'm the type of person that I never really had to work hard for a nice fit toned body. I was always athletic in school so I guess for me that wasn't hard work because those were things I was enjoying doing and I was doing it anyway and it just so happened that my natural body because of those activities was in shape. But now after having three kids and seeing how easy it is to go back to that flabby belly after I've worked so hard for two months just to tighten it up a little bit, not even completely where I want it to be. This is definitely a complete lifestyle change and I realized that today. I do not want to work so hard for two months doing Focus T25 just to get back to where I was at the end of Insanity when I should have had even better progress because I never quit in the first place. And my intention was not to quit after insanity. My intention was to continue to exercise and to continue like straight from one workout program to another, but I had to wait a while to get the, uh, it's just one excuse after the other, you hear me? I had to wait a while to get the Focus T25. Yes, that is true, but I had no excuse not to work out. I have the Insanity DVDs and I could have continued and I just didn't. I was just lazy. I was tired of working out for over an hour a day with Insanity and I didn't want to continue that. So it was just straight up, it was laziness. And the reason I'm sharing this embarrassing photo, these three photos side by side, is so that you can see from my mistake and learn from it. Don't quit. 
especially if you are a mom, you've had a couple kids, it's not as easy for you to keep the weight off, it's not as easy for you to keep your belly flat and toned anymore like it used to be maybe when you were a teenager like it was for me. So this is definitely a lifestyle change and <clears throat> I wanted to mention uh, what, what I've been noticing since taking the Shakeology. We, take, we ordered the vanilla Shakeology with our Focus C25 Challenge Pack and I have so been noticing a difference in my body, in my energy, even in my skin. I have had more energy, I've been more regular even though that's TMI, I mean it really does get out the junk out of your body and it puts in good healthy nutritional things that you need and your body desperately craves. And it's curbed, speaking of cravings, it's curbed my cravings for junk food. I am such a huge chips, cake, junk food type of person. Like, now what I've been snacking on is fruits. And even then, I try to restrict myself to no more than three, which it should only be two, snacks a day in between meals. <coughs> um, and actually, one of those is the Shakeology. So... One, one snack a day is a serving of a piece of fruit or something and then my breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Aside from curbing my crazy cravings, I've been noticing my skin clearing up and I, I'm 28, come on, and I still have acne problems. I've always had this issue since middle and high school and I still have breakouts. But I've been noticing that now with eating cleaner, I'm not saying we're on like a super clean, strict, healthy diet. But we are eating cleaner, we're being more cautious of what we buy, of how we cook our foods, and we're using Shakeology every day. And I've seen my skin clearing up. It's crazy. It's awesome. Another thing I've been noticing, did I say more energy? More energy throughout the day. And it's not like a jittery, hyper type of energy and then you get a crash. No, it's like a sustained energy throughout the entire day. Um, it helps me to feel full longer so that way I don't eat as much during the day and my portions are smaller because it helps with that. I've definitely just noticed a difference in it and the thing is it tastes good and there's so many different recipes that you can make out of it like berry recipes just straight up the vanilla shake with water or milk or whatever liquid you make it with and it tastes good no matter how you make it. So <clears throat> I definitely want to encourage you all, if you want to get in shape, or if you're already working out, don't quit. If you're about to finish a workout program, don't quit. Even if you're planning on purchasing a new workout program to continue your fitness, don't stop in between that time frame of when you finish your current workout program and when you receive your next workout program in the mail. Just do what you're doing now and continue. Start over from day one if you have to or mix and match some of them. Do an easy, uh, what you would consider an easier workout today and then tomorrow do one of the harder ones but don't stop because you saw my picture. I lost my, I lost my hard work. I worked hard for that, for my abs to start showing again just to have a little belly again two months later now starting T25. I mean, I'm really disappointed with that. But I'm really enjoying the Focus T25. My husband's doing Insanity. He's enjoying that. And I'm really looking forward to this being a lifestyle change instead of a mentality of, let me just get in shape and get my, my nice abs back and then I don't have to work for it anymore. No, I'm really looking forward to having to continually every day work towards being more healthy, being more fit, and not losing my results. I'm so determined to not lose my results now. It's crazy. If you're interested in working out, if you're interested in continuing a workout, um, and you don't have a coach, I'd be more than happy to come alongside you, encourage you, be there for you, help you out, answer any questions you may have regarding Beachbody workouts or Shakeology or any of the Beachbody nutritional supplements, the protein bars, any questions you have, even if it's not about Beachbody and you just have some general fitness questions or you just want somebody to be there for you to push you along in your workout, whether it's Beachbody or not, 
connect with me. Contact me somehow. Look in the description box below for my email. Um, how do you pronounce this? Kik, K-I-K, that instant messaging thing on the cell phone. You can message me through there. All of my contact information is in the description bar below. You can leave a comment on this video. You can private message me on this video. Send me a tweet. Check out my Facebook. Send me a private message on Facebook. There's tons of ways to get in touch with me. And every single one of those ways messages me on my phone when I get a new message anywhere. Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, Kik, the Kik, instant messaging, all of them. Go straight to my phone. I will get your message most of the time right away and if I'm not busy I'll be able to answer you right away because I don't have tons of followers yet to be able to uh, have to put people on hold so definitely don't give up I want to encourage you to keep on getting healthy getting fit it's not about you comparing yourself to anyone else it's about you comparing yourself to yourself make yourself a better you get healthier for you get healthier for your kids get more in shape, work out, get your abs cut if that's what you want to do so that you're happy with yourself. Of course, I, I want to say that I'm not unhappy with the way my body is now. Even with the progress that I lost, I'm happy with myself the way I am, but I do want to improve and I do want to get better and stronger, more healthy, and of course, I want to see my abs ripped. That's what I'm looking forward to. So, if that's what you want to, and you're serious about working out, you're serious about getting fit, and you're serious about having someone keep you accountable because I will keep you accountable and I will encourage you. Contact me so that we can work together and I can help you out. And you can help me out too because you guys are such a tremendous help to me in keeping me accountable in my workouts. When I slack on doing my YouTube videos, seriously, I slack on keeping my workouts up. I slack on keeping my house as tidy as it should be. In all honesty, I mean, if no one's going to see it, the mentality for me sometimes is, I'll just do it tomorrow. That is laziness. Come on, I'm trying to get out of that. And if you're struggling with it too, we can help each other. Contact me. Thank you guys so much for watching my video and encouraging me through my fitness journey. I really hope that uh, you will join me in this journey. If you have another coach, Feel free to still leave comments below, and I'm definitely here to encourage all of my viewers. I don't have to be your coach. I just want to be here for you guys because you guys support my channel, and I truly, truly appreciate that, and I want to support each of you individually as well in your journey, in your any goals that you have. Stay tuned next week. I will, again, be doing um, sh sharing my measurements and my uh, updated photos, so stay tuned each week so that you can keep me accountable on my workouts. Have a great day. Bye.